allowed me and my family to live for the last 21 years and to share this with friends and collaborators is an amazing moment. So thank you very much for being here. Um, I will be brief. I just want to introduce to you key persons to, to make this film happen. I want to invite here to John Taylor, the sound mixer. John, please. <laughs> Martin Hernandez, the sound designer for all my life. <laughs> to Nicholas Becker, sound designer, this one that you will see the sound of these guys. These three guys created the true universe. I would like to introduce Ana Terrazas, the costume designer. Carla Luna Cantu, executive producer. Carla. <laughs> Stacy Kirk, key producer of the film. <laughs> Michael Reiner, Nicolas Giacobone, my therapist. <laughs> Iker Solano, actor. <laughs> First time film, by the way. Jimena La Madrid, actor. Griselda Siciliani, actor. Griselda. Un aplauso, Griselda. And the guy who carried the film in the shoulders, el señor Daniel Jimenez Cat. Seats to the actor Omar Leiva. Omar, I don't know where you are, but an applause to Omar Leiva. <laughs> to Grace Chen, that did an amazing job. Araceli Torres, <laughs> Fabiola Guajardo, my dear friend, and the people with somebody so important in this film, Mary Parrot, which is a executive producer, and Natalia Gonzalez, executive producer. So thank you all of you guys. Without we have an amazing team in Mexico. It was a dream come true. Uh, their encounter with my city and my country. And uh, briefly, I will, you just want to invite you to this film. Come from a very uh, deep introspection that speaks about some personal memories, some intimate things, but at the same time from a collective memory from the country that I belong. I think as as millions of immigrants, I have in a way share the opportunity to be in this country, getting all the opportunities and all the dreams and all the things that I have been supported as many of us. But at the same time, there's no way to get out of the things that you lost. You know? When you leave something, there's some, a lot of friends, affections, your roots, your family, and there's suddenly a dual existence of the guy that you were there and the guy that you become and the thing that you integrate and disintegrate and that middle point is what this film talks about. There's a deep melancholy and nostalgia, but with humor and with light, because nothing is right or wrong or black and white. Everything's in the middle. That's the life that we live. So what I want to just express here is that there's no certainties, there's no answers. It's just in a state of mind that I share from the deep of my heart, that more than anything, I think that even when it's intimate and personal, it's universal because I think that the emotions and feelings that are here are shared by, by, by millions of people, even if you have an immigrate. When something is, you know, something, something ends, something is about to become, and that transition, when you question your narrative, when you question things, is where these films, were this, this film born from that sensation. I think it's about age. And I think is that they said that when you are about to go to the last immigration, your life appears in some kind of the slices and things like that. So this film, the fabric, is emotions, is memories, is feelings, is regrets, is fears, and navigates through the uh, reality and imagination. So please do not demand logic in this film. <laughs> there is no, there is no space for that in dreams. I just want to invite you to turn off your autopilot rational mind and enjoy the ride. There's a lot to feel, not to understand. There's a lot to laugh. And I hope that you ride the ride and you dream the dream. I hope you enjoy the film. Thank you very much.